Today, folks, I wanted to provide some brief insights, catalyst, what is going on with Serena Therapeutics, a biotechnology company that has its lead candidate focused on advanced Parkinson's, uh, likely heading into uh, clinical trials come Q4 of this year. They've recently had a capital raise to help support this, along with shareholder confidence that they've been posting to their YouTube channel that we're going to review in this video. Serena Therapeutics trades on the New York Stock Exchange under SER for around a $54 million market cap. The company did reach out to me as part of sponsored content. Of course, I'm leaving the disclaimers in the description below. This only constitute my own opinion for entertainment purposes only and is not financial advice. But if you enjoy exploring the biotech space, consider hitting that subscribe button because I love that these companies are forefronting and helping solve some of the major issues plaguing society today. And basically reading into this, we are developing proprietary drugs to treat neurological diseases. Our lead product candidate, SCR252 for advanced Parkinson's disease is anticipated to enter clinical trials in the fourth quarter of 2025. Our follow on candidate SCR270 for tardive dyskinesia is anticipated to enter IND enabling studies in the fourth quarter of 2025. Our current small molecule discovery and development works uh, work includes a focus on unlocking the potential of molecules across a range of CNS uh, indications and beyond. And we can kind of just see what they're working on here. And obviously the advanced Parkinson is the one that we're going to be focusing on in this video. But if we go into the main part of their website, they're developing next generation uh, polymer platform, which is optimizing how therapeutics perform in the body, turning good molecules into great medicines. At Serena Therapeutics, we are using next generation uh, polymer science to unlock the full potential of proven small molecule therapeutics. At the heart of our innovation is POZ Platform, a proprietary polymer platform that enables precise, controlled, and sustained drug exposure. Posolization fundamentally improves how drugs perform in the body, extending their delivery and administration intervals, reducing side effects, and enhancing patient experience. Backed by decades of research, a world-class team, and a powerful clinical and regulatory uh, study, Serena is transforming the future of drug optimization. And I want you to just take a quick listen to this this couple minute video here that really helps exemplify what's going on here. Serena Therapeutics is a clinical stage biotech company advancing a patented polymer platform called PAUSE designed to optimize how small molecule drugs perform in the body. Our lead program applies PAUSE to apomorphine, a well-established Parkinson's treatment. The result is SER252, a once-weekly subcutaneous injection developed to replace the invasive infusion-based therapies. The PAUSE platform is built on poly-2 oxazoline, a synthetic water-soluble polymer created by the same scientists who helped bring PEG, the most widely used polymers in medicine, to the world. With PAUSE, these scientists turn their focus to small molecule drugs. Using a proprietary process called posylation, we securely attach the pause polymer to existing drug molecules. This helps control how they behave in the body, how long they stay active, and how well they're tolerated by patients. In advanced Parkinson's care, many patients rely on complicated infusion systems, including external pumps, home health care support, and daily maintenance. These methods can lead to unpredictable off periods and frequent side effects. By applying posylation to apomorphine, Serena developed SER252, a once weekly injection designed to deliver continuous symptom relief, simplify treatment, and reduce complication. We're developing SER252 to align with the FDA's 505B2 regulatory pathway, which allows us to build on existing clinical data. This approach shortens development and timelines reduces cost and limits risk, the smart strategy that supports both patients and investors. Pause offers clear advantages, higher drug loading, steady and customizable release, no immune response, and safe clearance from the body. It's ideal for drugs with narrowed ghosts and windows, and it's agassable across a wide range of therapies. At Serena, our mission is to make proven therapies more effective and easier to use. Pause is the platform. Pausolation is the method, and SEO R252 is just the beginning. Now, of course, this is just a very high level overview. I'm not an expert in biotech, but they do a good job at breaking this down to make it so, you know, us, you know, retail investors could actually understand what's going on here. But regardless, if you take a look at the news, the company has done quite uh, well, raising up to $20 million. Uh, and as they mentioned, they did have some uh, FDA feedback as they head toward these trials, but they, they're well capitalized and they're putting themselves in a great position uh, to bring up some catalysts as we get results from these trials. And we actually have some shareholders and I like that they 
post these videos to their YouTube channels uh, or their YouTube channel, Serena Therapeutics. And go check it out. I'll leave the link in the description below. Uh, but take a quick listen because this does give some insight from the investor side of this as well. So I'm a value add investor as opposed to doing a passive ramp. This will get them through to a major inflection point, knowing whether they got the 505 v 2 starting their clinical trial in Australia, actually getting the first readout of the clinical trial. I think there's an extraordinary opportunity. You have a major drug in an unmet clinical need. So that's what I'm always looking for in this. And the other element with this is, right now we're in a biotech winter, it's really difficult raising capital. So you get your pick of the litter. I don't think I see every deal from every corner in the world, but I see two deals a week. So I see about 100 deals a year. So in this one, I'm very, very confident in management. I'm confident that Pearl that hasn't been discovered yet. On that note, I'll pass the question off to you. I'd love to know what you think about Serena Therapeutics in that comment section below and consider subscribing for future updates. But on that, as always, I look forward to catching you in the next one.